2290 tax. This is Casey. Hi, Casey. Uh, th my name's Kaylin. I just got an email from you saying that I had a rejected return. Okay, that happens all the time. Have okay. you logged into your account? Yes, I'm on my okay. account right now. So if you click on your e-file page, do you see that? E-file your taxes online? Okay, yeah, I'm looking at that. Okay, when you click on that, you'll see a big pink highlight at the bottom. Do you see it? Okay, let me scroll down. Okay, I, I yeah. see it. Sometimes you have to scroll down to see this, but to resume an incomplete or rejected return, it should be all highlighted in pink. Okay, it and is. It'll tell you why the return was rejected on the comment section. Do you see that? Mm-hmm. Looking at that. So it looks like your return was rejected for the most common reason in the book, which is name control. Okay. And that means the EIN number and business name you gave me don't match. Sometimes people use a DBA, sometimes they, they have like just a typo or they use their social security number instead of an EIN. Okay, let's see. Oh, I see what I did. That go truck and that's my DBA. Okay, perfect. Oh, thank perfect. goodness. It should be under my, my husband's name. Tommy Smith. Perfect. Okay, okay, so do you see that resume button in the yes. middle there? Uh -huh. Click on resume. Okay. And it's going to let you make that correction. So you said it should be Tommy Smith? Yes, Tommy Smith. Okay, so delete that company name and write in Tommy Smith. Okay. Okay? And then just scroll down to the bottom and hit save and continue. Everything else is saved for you. So, okay. All right. Keep going. So on step two, save and continue. On step three, save and continue. Okay. When you get to step four, your IRS payment. How did you want to pay taxes? Uh, last year I had, uh, or last time, what did I do? I think I did bank account. Okay. Okay. So you can save bank account again. I don't save bank account numbers online. It's just not good for your security if anybody else ever got in here. Okay. So you'll have to put in your bank account numbers again. Just enter it in. But okay. But rest assured, the IRS does not take taxes when a return has been rejected. So you're not paying twice here. You're not getting dinged twice for your taxes. Okay. Good. Thank goodness. Okay. So then once you've got this in, or you could change, you could say voucher instead and print your voucher. That'll work too. Whatever you'd like to do. Okay. Okay. But once you've got your mind made up, just keep saving and continuing. And you can reprint your tax documents here as well. Okay. But you've already really reviewed it. The only thing we updated was that company name. Yes. So check your box under penalty of perjury. You've so examined it and it looks good. And you'll see there's no credit card payment on step six. You don't have to pay oh, me again. Okay. You've good. already paid me, so resubmitting is free. Okay, perfect. Okay, sound good? Yes, thank goodness. All I'm right. so glad. Thank you for your help. No problem. You call us back anytime, okay? All right, thank you. Bye. Have a good one.